Hello everyone, today we're going to be taking a look at something a little different. I'm kind of switching gears a little bit. I'm still going to be doing the Brave Toys, Transformers, and the like, but kind of want to start getting into um, Mask and doing some toy reviews and, and whatnot. So this is going to be kind of like a quick little segue into that. So we have Mask, Mobile Armor Strike Command there. We have Matt Tracker, leader of Mask. We have Miles Mayhem, leader of Venom. This box set right here was released in 2011 by Shout Factory. It originally um, aired in 1985 to about 1988. So you can kind of get a feel of what the animation is going to be kind of like. Storyline, typical 80s, good guy versus bad guy. Um, it can be kind of cheesy because a lot of the episodes center around his son and his um, robotic companion, T-Bob. So The box set here says it's the complete series. Unfortunately, it's not. It is missing the last 11 episodes of the series called the Racing Series. I don't know if Shell Factory, um, I don't know if they didn't have the rights or didn't have the episodes, but hopefully someday we will actually get those. Um, this is a nice 12 DVD set, 65 episodes. Flip it to the back here, you can kind of read the back here. It does say it has some bonus features. The bonus features aren't as good as you would find like on a Transformers or G.I. Joe box set, but better than nothing. Here are the individual sets here. You can buy these um, separately. Volumes 1 through 3 and Volumes 4 through 6. They're kind of going with the Mask and Venom theme. So just open it up here. Unfortunately, it's a generic picture, kind of the same one that we see here. Same picture that we see actually on the box art too. Would have been nice if they could have put some of the other characters on here. On the back, we kind of get an episode guide. This box set, same thing, same picture, and again, episode guide on the back. There were some unofficial releases of this series in 2005, 2006. I do have some of those. They were done by Vortex, who did a couple of other 80s um, cartoons. But um, video quality on these aren't as great. Some of the episodes are just horrible. But it is the complete series. This does have the racing series, so... It would have been nice if it uh, could have been a little better, but oh well. But again, very nice series, covert, very um, innovative, I think, in the toys. It's kind of like G.I. Joe mixed in with Transformers, but um, very nice. This box set costs you around 40 to 50 bucks. The individual DVD sets, maybe around 20 But um, I'm going to start doing... Um, Mass Toys here, if you can see in the back, you can kind of see some of the vehicles. I'm going to start off with the racing series because that's the actual series I really enjoyed. Where um, The first two seasons was all about covert, secret um, identities and all that kind of stuff, but the racing series was just purely um, racing. They already knew their identities, and it was just the both both factions just racing each other, against each other for um, prizes and I don't know, other stuff. But. So this has just been a quick little look at the Shout Factory box set. Thanks for watching, take care, and I'll talk to you guys later.